starting. Hello. Hey, we're doing another car video, but this time there's like a lot of snow around us. So um, we're going to talk about, I'm waiting for Mr. Poodle and my husband to come back from a little walk. We're in very snowy Jackson Hole, Wyoming. So let me just buckle up, give everybody a chance to come on here. So, you know, I made, I made an agreement with myself to come on and you, um, every day for about a month, I think we're around halfway through it or so, maybe, yeah, a little bit, or at least on social media every day for about, um, a month. Really having a backup plan. If it's just some little thing at home or if you're building your list or if you're going online and you don't have a signal or you're doing photos and you don't have a photographer and you only have your phone, whatever it is, you should always have some kind of back a backup plan because if you don't, you end up with a liver ailment in the summer. It was really kind of freaking out. I mean, I was like sobbing and they kind of didn't know if it was the C word or if it was something that they never knew existed because of his crud, cruddy teeth and they never did these tests before, but he had sonograms and oh, all sorts of like in and out of clinics and things and homeopathic people, vets and um, luckily, luckily, here he is, here's Mr. Snowball. Yeah, I got your seatbelt. I he can put his um, seatbelt on in his his leash. So luckily enough, he there he is. There he is, back from his little walk. Come here, hairball. So luckily he's doing really, really well, really well. But what's happened is when we were packing, I thought my husband took his supplements. My husband thought. I took his supplements and he gets his what we call his squirtles multiple times a day and he doesn't have his squirtles now I could have someone who has keys to my house go in and, and send them out here in Jackson but that would even take longer for her to figure out where they are so I decided to try to figure out how to get them here in Jackson and actual vet out here and get on Amazon. So we're gonna be good on this tomorrow. So he's only gonna be missing two days, which is really not that big a deal since he's at the end of this treatment. But the point is we had a backup plan. We had the ability to find a different way of getting something rather than being completely stressed out that it was impossible. And it's the same thing like when you're doing live I'm going to teach you pretty much everything you need to know to be able to stand out and take your own photos, become more online with your business and your brand, and, and be able to really just go and have the confidence to get out there so that you can attract the type of people you want and be able to scale the audience that you want to have by simply being the best at being you. I'm getting really white here so you know what's happening is with this phone is that it is so snow covered 
There's our little market. You see, see how snowy it is here. We're just we're getting out of our driveway. So it's so snow covered here right now that what's happening is that it's like overridden with white balance on this phone, and it doesn't know how to even doesn't know how to even find me with so much white around it. So, but that's okay. It's live. It's real, and that's kind of about all it is. So, um, if you have any other questions, don't let me just let me just put you in front of me so you can. See this is how snowy it is here in Jackson. It's really very pretty. And this is the main road to um, get out of here. And I'm going to show you a funny sign. Hold on. It's coming. Well, it's not funny, but I'll let you know where I'm at. Do you see this electric sign over here? It says Moose in Area Alert because this road is known to have a lot of moose on it. And sadly, um, Sadly, there have been some moose lost along the way because of people didn't see them crossing. And now they've lowered the um, speed limit and they have these markers all over wherever a moose was hit, they have a marker for it. So there's one um, over there. I don't think you can see that one. There's one over here. Do you see this? Look, you see? There he is. There's like a little moose. That means that sadly a moose became road krill and we love our moose out here so anyway that's it so always have a backup plan guys whatever it is know whatever you can do so that you're never stressed out you're never lost you never feel like you don't know what to do you always know another way to to get the same results and sometimes especially in business and the way the market is quickly changing that what worked for you two years ago or even last year doesn't work for you anymore like for instance like something as simple as email of course you need an email list we all have our email list and it's a wonderful way of communicating with people but what's happened is it's just not as effective as it used to be because people are bombarded with so many emails there's been so many restrictions between um, what, what Google has been doing with the GDPR that that people just don't see it you know you your best emails can end up in someone's promotion folder and they never see it so you need another way of communicating communicating with the same people and that really is relying on social media so that but not posting you know truly only you know what I went to the gym today or had for breakfast unless you could somehow tie it into something important for people or you feel that whatever it is is a shit is a great share for your audience to get to know you more but as a way of also connecting with people that they get to see your real you and your life whether it be in photos or in videos that they get to know a part of you and that really really absolutely increases the know like and trust factor so that when they do get an email from you they will open it up or you can be seen or when you go to a business event or a networking event that people recognize you because they've been following you on social media and you look real but not real in the schlumpy dumpy way but real in the best at being you in that particular life situation so a lot of people what happens is they create these fake branding shoots or they have a photographer do these really stiff photos and you know studies show people don't relate to that they real they they smell at inauthentic Authenticity. They smell up someone being fake and it doesn't serve you. So you want to just be real and it's so much easier to just be you and have a personality. So that's it. And I invite you to join me at AuthenticSuperstar.com. I'm going to get off right now because I'm going to have to give my husband a little bit of directions to where we're going. So it's a left and then I believe the first right or the second. I mean a right. I'm sorry. It's in Wilson. We're going to Wilson first. So, um, so it's the first one is the right and then uh, Fish Creek. So anyway, that's it guys. I'll see you soon. Let me know, maybe I'll pop in again later. And um, here, let me put you around. This is our big turn. This is our big turn. You see how white it is? But look how pretty it is here as we go. It's really, so this place right across the way of the turn, this is a real, the snake river. Whoops, the Snake River is that away, and that's a huge, huge um, moose congregation area. And sometimes there's some big bull moose that you see here. So, anyway, that's it, guys. If I do see a moose on this trip, I will either take a picture or come back on and show you. See you guys soon, and let me know what you need below in the comments. And please join me at AuthenticSuperstar.com. See you soon. Bye bye.